We're back. On April 9, 1865, the Confederate Army surrendered to the Union Army at Appomattox, ending the war between the states. The battle was not over for my brothers, however, as Colonel Barnsby had yet to put down his arms and was determined to see them hang. Three of us headed west to Fort Smith, Arkansas, a lawless town full of gamblers, drifters, and gunslingers, a place where people knew better than to ask questions. We still hope to rebuild our family farm someday, but for now, that was only a dream. For you see, the war had changed my brothers. They had become cold and violent men who took what they wanted without care or conscience. Hmm. So the war changed them and they headed to another town and it looks like Ray or Thomas is flirting with some chick on the left. And Ray's scaring off the other hillbillies, like, hey, get out of here! So, yeah. Let's start chapter three. At the saloon. What are you two doing? Nothing. We're just having a friendly disagreement. Why is this your business, little brother? Why is it my business? Because I don't want to get kicked out of another town. Well, I don't either. Especially since Thomas here might have a little one on the way. You go to hell. She was mine. Yours? Are you kidding me? What's this all about? Tell him, Tommy. Unless you already forgot her name. Which I doubt, since you just finished screwing her. Betsy ain't none of his business. Betsy? The Marshal's daughter? Are you out of your mind? Little Coquette kept flirting with me. If the Marshal finds out, he's gonna... Oh! Get your ass out of here, McCall! I want to know which one of you animals touched my little girl. You! You! Sheriff! What the hell is wrong with you two? You act like the war never ended! That you can just take what you want! Well, you know what? It's time you cross the wrong son of a bitch! You tell me who did this to my daughter, or I will gun down both of you! It was me! He's lying, Sheriff. I did it. Or maybe it was both of us. Oh, shut up, Ray. That girl does like a good time. You're the deputy marshal. You gotta keep your head here. This ain't your business, boy. <laughs> now I'm not the marshal. So let's go. Time to dance with the devil. Ray, Thomas, please, please, walk away. There ain't no walking away from this, boy. One, two, three! Happy New Year. Okay, so what do we do now? We get to decide who we get to play as now, instead of just each chapter picking us one. Um, Agile, deadly with a long range file, use the lasso, can use bow. Strong, deadly at close range with dual wield rifles, can carry Gatling gun, uses dynamite to blow things. I'm gonna play as Ray for this chapter because he has dynamite. Yeah, I'll, I'll play as Thomas next chapter, I promise. But for now, we'll play as Ray. Are we having a old western shootout? Defeat the sheriff and shootout. Use A and D to move and see your enemy. I can't see you. Okay, now I can see you. Use the mouse to control your hand. Okay. Keep your hand close to your gun, but don't reach for it too early. Yeah, otherwise he'll say, uh uh uh. When you hear the bell, reach for the gun with mouse and shoot. Okay. Oh, there we go. Oh! I killed you. 
I hope there are more shootouts like this. That was fun. Why? Uh oh, uh oh, who's shooting at us? Saloon, okay. Oh, I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh, come on. Oh, don't look at the picture, naked person. Whoa. Kill them. Ah, oh. reload, reload. Oh, I think we gotta get out of here. We go upstairs or where? Yeah, we have to escape. Let's go upstairs. Come on, guys. Let's go. Come on, you guys. We gotta get out of here. And as we escape from the saloon, we will wrap up the episode here. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like and a comment, if you would please. And until next time, guys, we will see you all later. Bye-bye.